How are you? Of class 8 student. Thank you, I am fine. I hope that you are also fine. In previous class, we had read about Shamima's story. Shamima was a ill-fated girl, but she is now winner. Today, we read Shamima had not outward beauty, but she had inner beauty. So, our today title is Ibar Beautiful Shamima. Ibar Beautiful. You will read the passage silently, but I read it loudly. Shamima's misery started the day she was married. Her husband was a greedy person and he used to abuse her verbally and physically. Within a few months, into her marriage, she had to let her husband come out of the world. Now, Shamima was to work with women who are ill-fated like her. She has 43 female members in her organization working for her. She herself trains the members and then provides them with work. She designs fabric, makes block paint, brush paint and hand embroidered shirts. She also makes three pieces desks for women and cocoas for men. She sells this product in her shop and supplies them outside. Shamima has a dream now, a dream to something for the helpless people. She wants them to feel useful. They can live with self-respect and dignity with this in view. She goes out working for such people. Shamima finished her story with a smile. Shamima has no complaints, no regrets, no grace. Her husband could destroy her outward beauty, but not the beauty.
activity of her mind. All she wants to do is to bring a smile on the faces of those women who are unfortunate. Shamima wants to become a famous designer. Dear student of class 8, we have finished. Read the pages. Now we can see some new words. I guess the new words are the uh -huh. 